I've done. Okay, so hopefully you can see me. I'll try and make sure my instructions are clear because there's light coming in from every angle, which is unusual in the UK. So we'll get started pretty much straight away. So just take it into second position. Take your arms out and just give themselves some length. And we're just going to take a kick and overhead. So we won't do cardio today because I think a few of you are outside. So, um, yeah. We'll do lots of precision, lots of strength. Try to put the shorts on. I am big. If I, you won't be able to see her on the camera, but I've got like a cluster of about five bites on the top of my thigh, three running down the side, and about four on my calf. It's really weird. I never get bit when I'm abroad. They're very rare. But anyway, it is like being abroad, isn't it? And eight. Seven, six, hopefully you've got some nice summer tunes banging out. Four, three, two, take it straight into that tondu. We take it down and over. And for seven, and for six, and for five, four, three, two, big toe, one other side, and eight, seven, this is as much cardio as we're getting. Five, Four, three, two, next one into a big grand bottom line. And lift. Black more for two. Three. Four. I said wish I could speak French. Three. Two. Other side. Five. Eight. Five. I don't know why I said five. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. Alternate for eight, for seven, for six, for five, mat breath already, four, three, two, into plie, three, two, one, for eight, for seven, for six, I love my studio that it's got so much light, but hopefully we'll burn some cameras, eight, seven, six, Let's go the other side, draw the tummy in, take it around. 
didn't do any side leg in the other ones, so we're going to do quite a bit of side leg today. But we did lots of bridge ones. Hold. And up, well done. Let's go into that plie curtsy. So we're going to do four on one side, four on the other. Two, two, one, one. Okay, so three, two, and we take it down and back. And two. And three. And four at the side. Four, three, two, one, and for two, and for two, for one other side, two, one, and one, alternate for eight. This is seven, this is six, this is five, this is four, this is three, this is two. This is one, reverse it all again for four. We go four, three, two, one, other side, four, three, two, one, and for two, 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 other side, two, two, alternate for eight, eight, nearly there, seven, six, we might just do five minutes today. <laughs> Four, three, two, boom, and one. Huh. Well done. Get your breath. Take a little drink, guys, if you need. Just keep hydrated today. It's not Coca-Cola this way, but it's, uh, <laughs> it's water with a little bit of Phytolife, which is a green, basically a tea tablespoon of um, just vegetables, but not like literally in a liquid form. It's really nice, like a minty taste, but sometimes I forget. Oh no, sorry, I'm just going to ignore that darling, sorry, I normally take my do not disturb on, so it would miss him. My son's probably wanting a lift. We met a couple of friends last night, I think they were cooking some um, beer drinking because he's not working today. So that one that came and he stayed with his friends up in, in the tent in the garden, social distancing. Okay, let's take it into a lunge position. So, shoulders down, back leg really nice and long, so you've got that nice stretch through the quadriceps. And draw the tummy in, pick your weights up. If you don't want to use weights, you don't have to. We're going to do some abs as well on the floor today. Take it down. And for two. And for three. And for four. And for four. For three. Two straight into arabesque. So we'll take it up. Lift arabesque one. And two. And three. I'm sure a French person would die at the way I pronounce arabesque. Two, one to the side, draw the tummy in, first seven, first six, first five, first four, try and keep to your gears up, not your head, just your eyes, really weird, two, and one, well done, switch sides, draw the tummy in, take it down for eight, four, seven, four, six, glue your elbows in, five, Four, three, two, one, take it forward, lift, and seven, and six, you don't want to hammer them, do you, on a day like today, though? Four, three, two, one, to the side, eight, seven, six, I hope you're all sweating like me, five, Four. I had leggings on early, I had to take them off. It's too hot. Two, one, well done. Back into lunge. The opposite side again. This time we're going to do that little heel raise. We come down. Nice long leg at the back. Take it up. Lower. Two, three. If you can't balance, it's quite hard this one. Just keep the heel down and do your arm action. Four, three, two. Hold it up on this next one. Take it up, lower. 
down, up, lower, quite hard this one, three, four, four more, four, three, two, I can feel perspiration trickling down my leg, well done, other side, so nice and long, tight through the tummy, just take it up for eight, for seven, for six, for five, it's like big come back, four, three, two, hold it up if you can, I know these are hard on balance, if you can, don't worry, they're not easy, seven, down for six, and for five, and for four, and for three, and for two, and for one, good work, that leg, does it do that one? You'll have to forgive me, the sun's gone to my head. Okay, let's take it into that wide position overhead reach. So draw the core in, tight through, I'm really wrong, <laughs> down, overhead. I need a fan, do I? My studio. Four, four more, four, three, two, four, and again, eight. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Well done. We'll just take it into our tricep work. Nice length through the back leg. So push that back heel down to the floor. Weights into the side of the ribs. Take it out. Hold it. And in. And out. And in, and out, and in, I'll stay still. You might want to see my sweat face. Four, three, two, one. Take it out, slide the scapula down, lift, straight arms. Two, three, four, four, three, two, one. Keep your legs where they are, bring it in to reach back, row back. Two, three. Four, four, three, two, one. Well done. The other side. Do you know I watered some plants last night? The buds, honestly, I'll show you the plant at the end. The buds were completely closed. Watered them, and they've like literally overnight they've come into this beautiful purple flower. And again, eight, seven, six, five. Four, three, two, one. Hold it, slide the scapula down, lift your arms as high as you can. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. What did we do last? We did something else, didn't we? La la la, that's it. Pull back, row. Seven, six, five, four, Three, squeeze the scapula together. Two and one. Well done. Okay, let's do, let's see if we can, yeah. Just keep holding one weight. Just, I just feel like we're there. Perspiration away. It's not a glamorous life, is it? Draw the tummy in. And we're going to take this arm up to abduction. Slightly lower, elbow slightly lower than your um, shoulder. And lift the leg. So draw the tummy in, slide the scapula down and lift. And two. And three. And four. And four. And three. And two. And one. You don't have to do your arm action with the weight if you don't want to. And seven. And six. And five. And four. And three. And two, we're going to hold it up. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Well done. Other side. I'm sure we're working so much harder than any of the other ones. And again, take it eight. All right. Seven, that's right, isn't it? Six, five, four, three. One, and again for eight, for seven, for six, for five, for four, for three, for 
Fourteen. Four, one. Hold it. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Well done. Take your weight down. Let's just feel a little bit of a stretch. Kick it out. Push it in. Into tricep, push that palm into the middle of the shoulder blades, push the elbow down. We'll go into a balance section. You like that one? I'll give you some balance. A little bit more balance. And either way, push it down. Just clasp your hands and just really round that upper back. And then pull it so you're stretching through the pectoral wall. You can get super tight sort of through here, especially if you do plank work. And again, one more time. And our back. <laughs> if you can see, guys, the sweat falling down my face, running, sun cream running into my arms. Okay, what we're going to do is just do a little bit of um, tree pose, but into a little bit of flow movement, if we can. Push it out. And for two. And for three. And for four. And for four. Can you see my legs are round? Four. Three. Two. One. Eight more if we can. For eight. There's seven. Oh, it's all full. You've got sun cream in your eyes, guys. Five, four, three, two, one. Bring it in. Take it up. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Take it to the back. Take it into quad stretch and into your dancer's pose. Try and just be zen like. Hold, just be grateful for your body and how it's holding you up on one leg. Feel that healing a little bit more. Hold the pose a bit longer, I want your legs to shake a bit. And gently. Down. Straighten that front leg, take it down. Bend the front knee and gently start back up. Well done, let's go to the other side. Okie dokie. External rotation, just bring it up to the knee and take it out for eight, for seven, for six, for five. Hold on if you need four. Four, three, two, I think we need one more there, so let's go at eight, let's go seven, let's go six, let's go five, let's go four, let's go three, let's go two, one, bring it in, take it up, seven, six, five, this left foot is uh, slipping, I can tell, four, three, two, one more set. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. I'm not sure how much risk assessment is going into this next one because my leg, my foot is soggy. And hold, hold, hold. And relax, well done. And just that leg you've just been lifting, uh, standing on, just take it down into the hamstring. Feel that stretch. And slowly back up. Well done. I'm just going to get my mat, guys. So we're just going to walk it out. I'm hoping um, the 
motion and sweat is good for uh, energy guys. Okay, so we're going to walk it into that walk out plank. I want you to have your legs a little bit wider than you would have if you were doing a roll down. Yes, so what we're going to do is walk it down for four walk out planks, pushing the heels down when we start to move up into downward dog to stretch the hamstrings out. <laughs> okay, chin to chest, set the hips backward. Gently down. And walk it in. Feel the stretch, not stretch, the stretch, lift it. Make sure you've got that perfect, perfect plank. Draw the tummy in. Tuck the hips nice and high. Just start walking the heels down, walking it back, restacking back up. So think more mobility. Chin to chest, take it down. I know some of you love your yoga, so you might have missed some of the yoga yesterday. So we might do a little bit of yoga flow. Just hold. Take it up again. Tuck the heels down. We've got two more of those. On the fourth one, we'll just take it into a Kataranga and a Cobra. Set the hips backwards, gently down. Hold again. Set the hips up, walk it back again. So good for creating, particularly if you tighten the hamstrings, so good for just creating that length through the back of the legs again. And out. Bring your feet a bit closer together this time. See if you can take it into your bent elbow position all the way down to the floor. Like a snake, bring it up. You can come up like that as well if you want. Just take a breath in. Up the toes, tuck the hips nice and high. Walk the hands back, tuck the heels down. Walk it back. And let's do that three more times. Chin to chest, tuck the hips back. Walk it down, feel it length in the legs, walk it in, get your full plank. You can set the knees down if it's too much, come into your elbows back, up, take a breath in, up the toes under, set the hips nice and high, walk it back again. Oh, my hamstrings are beginning to just feel really lovely now, yeah, taking that tightness away. Last one, chin to chest, hips down, hips down, head chin down even, kick it, drop, and elbows all the way to the floor, up into your cobra position, stretching the abdominals, tuck the toes straight into your plank position, okay, let's get a little bit of core work going, bring the right knee in, and the left, and the right, and the left, and the right, and the left. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Take the hips up, walk it back a little bit, take the right leg nice and high, externally rotate that foot in towards the butt cheek. And if we can, can you take that leg now and bring it forward? Yeah, into your high lunge and just hold. Take the hands on, reach up, bend the knee a little bit, feel that stretch. Good, take both hands to the inside of the foot, walk it back around. Tight through the tummy. Let's go again for eight. First seven. First six. First five. First four. I'm in the shade now. That's nice. Three. Two. Sorry, Ali, if you're a psycho. Eight more. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. One. Left leg, so come up, take it up, take it in, hold. Quite tough this one, so if it's too much, just come on to knees to come into your high lunge. Quite hard mobilisation-wise to do that. And just 
gently down, stretch that hip, 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 knee. So get that nice stretch through. And take it into this position now. We're going to get half out. Set the hips backwards, gently down. Oh, let yourself hang, really hang. Set the hands onto the forehead and just gently side to side. Side to side. And slowly bring your legs back together. And slowly up. Good. Okay, let's come down onto the floor. Let's take it into our, I don't know what part of my body is warmer. We'll just do um, three little bridges. We did that, I did this in the other class, but we'll just do three little bridges. If you've got your ball, grab hold of your ball to put between your inner thighs. Have a little drink as well. And then if we get time, we will do some side work as well. So, take the ball, squeeze it between your inner thighs. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> it's not pleasant, is it, when you're wearing it? It's horrible. Okay, so, we're going to draw the navel in. We're going to spread the collarbones nice and wide. We're going to take a breath in through our nose, little chin now. Exhale, gently send the lower back into the mat and come up. Can you see my focal figure? Great. So when you're in your um, bridge position, guys, you want to think about that navel to spine connecting in towards it. Yes, yeah, so navel towards the back row. And you want your hips nice and high. So hip bones high. Yeah. Shoulder blades down the back. That's your perfect position. Walk your heels a little bit closer. I'm going to come up onto the balls of my feet, but I might bring them down quite quickly. So working through the calves, squeeze the bum, squeeze the bum, sorry, squeeze the inner thighs. I'm not sure my legs are going to keep hold of this. I think uh, the ball's slipping with the perspiration. So squeeze the ball, squeeze. If you've not got a ball, you can just squeeze the legs in. Squeeze, get the inner thighs to touch. Squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. Squeeze, squeeze, drop the butt, lift, drop the two, drop the three, drop the four, drop the four, drop the three, drop the two, drop the one, and again, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, set the heels down, take a breath in, slowly lower back down. Good, let's go again, either with or without the ball. Gently back, come on up, come on up, tight through the tummy, squeeze, 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 nice and quick, four, three, two, one, drop the foot, lift, drop, lift, two, three, four, four, three, two, one, into, um, into twang, well you know what, I'll say that. So you go in, out, drop, lift. In, out, drop, lift. In, out, drop, lift. Woo! Four. Three. Two. One. I'm enjoying myself. I'm not sure you guys are. Gently down. Oh, last one. I like 45 minutes after. Feel like you can go at quite a decent speed. And again. Up again. Lift it up. In, out, drop, lift. In, out, drop, lift. Last but 
that list, let's go into that step or really good in this class, aren't we, with them uh, roll ups? So, if you've got a ball, sometimes it just gives you that little bit of um, external impetus so you can look at it. So, take your body, if not, just your hands backwards. Know what happens here. So, if you watch through here, the ribs come up and out, and when you come up, you want them to send them in. Yeah? So, Oh, sorry guys, I just had a little pull there. Not really. <laughs> so, remember what we're doing in roll-ups. Look at what the back's doing. Take a breath in through the nose. Exhale, start taking it forward, chin to chest, gently roll over. So I'm going to do four of these with you guys, and then carry on, just keep going. I'm slipping, and out, I'm slipping all over the wood. <laughs> Like a bad bow party or something. I know my bow party days are looking always really good on the floor. Always restart back up. If you feel that you're going a bit kyphotic, kyphosis through there, then keep the shoulders down. If you're liking this and it's a warm day and actually you think, you know what, I'm just happy to do normal roll up. Continue. If you want something more, bring the right knee in, left knee in, right knee, lower back down before we lift. Good work. Oh, you can flex the foot. Yeah? We've done quite a lot of hands. 
hamstring stretches today with um, walking planks and stuff. So I'm going to point my foot so that I'm working the back leg a little bit more. Keep drawing that core in. Kneeling. Oh, I can't wait to get the shower. And just come on to 